Of course, we are here today to talk about episode nine, the movie that completes the Skywalker saga. So, let's get this thing started. It is my pleasure to introduce the president of Lucasfilm, Kathleen Kennedy, and the director of episode nine, J.J. Abrams. Hello. I think it's what we tried to do, despite this being this epic space adventure that takes place on many worlds and in, in many places, um, <laughs> that we, we did everything we could, uh, building sets, uh, exterior and exterior, uh, interior and exterior, going to locations um, in and around uh, in, in England and in Jordan and other places. We did everything we could to have it in camera. One of my favorite things as a kid, and I still remember that visceral feeling at 10 years old, you know, seeing, uh, you know, looking at, at what I learned later was Tunisia, but it would felt like you knew you were in a real place. It was, you know, and, and to one of the infinite number of brilliant strokes that George had was to tell the this, this story in, in physical, actual, real locations. That's Jordan, uh, you know, the location. Wadi Rum. Wadi Rum where they shot, you know, Lawrence of Arabia, and you get there and you're just looking around, you can't believe what you're seeing, and it's amazing to have the, uh, the, the, the sort of that kind of beautiful nature uh, as a backdrop for sequences. Uh, so we tried to keep it as real as possible, as physical as possible. It was better for the actors, better for the movie. I want to know what it was like shooting in Jordan. What was it like to be out there in the, for all of this is a question for any of you, what was it like to be out there in that desert? Anthony, compare that to Tunisia. What was Jordan like compared to Tunisia? Jordan was a, a truly remarkable experience. Uh, the first day, driving out there on the set, it was my wife, Christine, who said, but this is Ralph McQuarrie's painting. The, the backdrops, those stone faces that you're looking at, and I would get goosebumps every day we drove out 45 minutes from the hotel, and it was, oh, it sounds corny, it, it was beyond a privilege to be there. And remarkably, the desert put up with us. Every day it tried to gain itself back to cover the roads that had been built to put us in to say goodbye, no, enough, leave us alone. It was the most astounding setting to be in. And the Jordanian people, the Jordanian army, everybody there really were part of, part of our kind of family. It was a glorious experience. Uh, Kathy and JJ, how long were you guys in the desert? Well, actually we had a crew there prepping um, for months prior to us arriving, and then we shot for about three weeks. It, it was an amazing thing, and we did. We had hundreds of people in in unbelievable costumes that Michael Kaplan designed. We had incredible creatures that Neil Scanlon and 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 his team designed. So to be there with literally hundreds of people and in the the heat of it, and having to take you know food breaks and bathroom breaks and prayer breaks, and it was a whole thing. Uh, but we got through it and actually finished a day ahead of schedule.